Hello and welcome to another UMake tutorial. My name is Nico and in this tutorial I want to talk about erasing in UMake. Everything that you create in UMake, whether it's a curve, a surface, or a group of curves and surfaces, are treated as objects. This means that anything that you select is an object. And it also means that with curves, you can't just erase a section of a curve like you can in other software. A curve is actually an object. To select a curve or an object, simply double tap on it. Once you have it selected, you'll notice that it changes color, and you'll also notice that the side menu pops up. In this tutorial, we're covering erasing. So to erase a curve, you're going to use the erase function in the side menu. Tap erase, and the curve will be gone. Now, there's another way with curves that you can erase them. If you're sketching in 3D space and you just need to quickly get rid of a curve that you don't want anymore, you can use a quick shape of an N or Z to get rid of the curve. We call this the squiggle technique. So you just draw a little squiggle and your curve will go away. So I'm going to erase this curve for good now. There we go. Moving on to surfaces. If you draw the squiggle on a surface, for example, it won't go. You'll just get a curve that looks like a big squiggle. To erase a surface, simply double tap on it to select it and then tap erase. In this case, there were some edge curves around the surface. So if I go back and tap undo to bring back the surface, if I want to select everything here, I can use the lasso tool. I'm going to tap and hold on the lasso tool and I'm going to draw a selection around the curves and surface here. And now I can erase all of those objects. Tap Erase, and that surface is now gone. With groups, it's kind of a mixed bag. If I double tap to select the group, you'll see that I have a surface of this sphere and the curve selected. However, if I want to get rid of just the curve, I can actually use the squiggle technique and the curve will disappear. If I bring the curve back and I just want to delete the entire group, I can double tap on the object or the, the group and then tap erase and everything is gone. Our canvas is now clear because we have erased everything. I hope this tutorial was helpful and useful for you. If you have any questions, comments, or feedback, feel free to let us know on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, or Instagram. Have a great day and happy creating.